Oh, I almost ran him over. Stop running, dude. You're gonna get tasered. You're gonna get tasered. Oh, I'm surprised I actually hit him. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to LSPDFR. Jumping in here with a old school Dodge Charger. This is one that I thought I had threw a... Uh, I don't even remember the last fucking... <laughs> the department we did. Um, it's one in LA. I just really can't remember it off the top right now. Um, but I thought I had put that texture on here, but I did not. So I actually have two that have this texture on it. So we'll just go ahead and use these two with the textures they have on. Because they're actually really nice looking. So we'll just kind of be working all around Los Santos. I'm going to go ahead and activate my calls. And we kind of see what's going on. I'll throw on the lights for you. All these lights on these cars are relatively universal um standard you know what i mean they have the same look which is good i love cars like that always a beautiful thing uh but yeah we'll go ahead and see what we can get into here i see a little white dot on the map they are spinning their tires i don't hear any screeching though but they're spinning their tires oh there we go now i wanted to kick in he is just dumping smoke i think i'm gonna wait for yeah they're turning this way i'm gonna i'm gonna throw a u-turn and we're gonna go ahead and light him up for that and honking at someone that's in a crosswalk when they have the right of way. Yep, they're definitely gonna get lit up. Okay, let's go ahead and see what we got here. Pull over, buddy. You know you you know you're doing wrong if you're gonna be honking and acting like a jackass. Pull the fuck over. Okay, we're just slow rolling. I don't know if this is just him trying to find a location or what. Driver, pull your vehicle over. He ain't stopping. Oh, yeah, he's stopping. Just stop. Holy shit, dude. Lit him up like a block away. Just now came to a stop. Dispatch, I gotta stop Eclipse Boulevard. Gentry Lane. We'll see what this guy's deal is. How you doing, sir? Stop today because you were spinning your tires and then you also honked at a pedestrian when they had the right of way. If I get your license, please. Just gonna have to back away here because menus be loving to overlay on each other. Identification, sir. Alexander Gorski. Alright, sit tight for me, man. That is one hell of a name. <laughs> that really is, though. Okay, let's go ahead and see. Uh, gotta make sure I do it so it doesn't hit the horn consecutively. Alex, I love how I don't have to remember it too if I don't want to. He does have a gun permit. It's going to be a handgun and concealed. Uh, he does have to warn us about it, which I don't think he did. An improper turn in jaywalk. Holy shit. He honked at someone who was in a crosswalk and he has a fucking fine for jaywalking. This asshole, dude. Are you kidding me? Wow. All right, we're going to run his name or run his uh, vehicle. Valid, valid, no. Valid, no. Okay, so let's go ahead. He, he's looking good on that. Um, it's funny that he, it's the irony in that, it's pretty interesting. We're gonna go ahead and give him a citation today for the behavior that he displayed, uh, over there when he was spinning his tires and all that. Pretty much reckless driving. Oh, gotta love it. Yep, just give me a second while I look like a crackhead. Okay, so today, uh, we're gonna be giving you a citation today, okay? It's gonna be for your reckless driving. Wait there! Oh, shit. Be for your reckless driving... Okay, I get, I get select the fences. So we're gonna do... Reckless driving. Three points on your license, $650 fine. And uh, don't honk at anyone. I saw you have a you have a jaywalking ticket. I don't know why you would be honking at someone who was actually using the crosswalk, yet you like to get jaywalking tickets. So don't be doing that, okay? I'm not gonna give you a ticket for, for that, but don't be honking at people for using the crosswalk. Have a good day, sir. All right, nice and simple. Nothing too crazy from that. Dispatch, we're going to be code 4108 available for calls. Okay, we're going to stop this guy in the black, uh, it's kind of, I can't remember the name. It's a Mustang type vehicle. He is in the sidewalk, or in the crosswalk. I don't know why I've seen so many crosswalk violations today, but this dude is straight up in the crosswalk. So we're going to light him uh, up for MP. Ooh, he just got rear-ended too. Andy Red, okay. What is going on? Driver, pull to the right-hand side of the road. Her dad is going to be so pissed. There's another 
Oh, not too much. Not not on the curb side of the road. Just just on the side of the road. Dispatch, we're going to have traffic stop. East Vinewood Boulevard. On a black two-door coupe. Muscle car. Occupied times one. No 32. Uh, let's see what's going on with this guy. He was dead in the middle of that side, uh, the crosswalk, and then also ran the red light. I understand he got rear-ended, but he took off. A little bit of a difference there. How you doing, sir? Stopped you today because you got into a uh, little bit of a little bit of an accident with someone there, and you also were just stopped in the crosswalk. If I get your identification, please. All right, Michael Thomas, just sit tight for me, all right? Let's see what's going on with this guy's name. Lock up our ELS. Michael Thomas, arrest warrant, resisting arrest with violence, felony. Okay, so we're not even going to run the, <laughs> we're not even going to run the name here. I'm going to go unavailable for calls since it's a pretty serious offense. Let's just go ahead and open the door, pull out our firearm, and we're going to get him out of the vehicle. Driver, do me a favor, step out with your hands up. This is LSPT. Hands up. No move. Get on the ground, face down. Dispatch, I got a felony arrest warrant on uh, the driver here. I'm going to go ahead and go take him into custody. Let's see if we get him nice and smooth. He's cooperated so far, though. Stand up. Okay, we're going to get him to the side of the road, pat him down, make sure he has nothing on him. That was actually pretty smooth for a uh, felony arrest warrant for resisting arrest with a violence. Um, <laughs> you'd assume that there would have been some violence. Shit, my door's open. Let me just go ahead and take him back over there really quick. Boom. There you go. Now traffic can flow. Alright, you got anything on you that's gonna stick, poke, or hurt me, man? Pat him down, make sure he has nothing on him. He's gonna have a smartphone, a condom, and a used needle. What a selection. What a damn selection. Let's go ahead and call prisoner transport out for this guy since he does have a felony arrest warrant. He's have to go in for that. They'll probably send him out code three. Because you already know they got to get shit done. I see him, but I don't hear a siren. That might be good. This guy is so broken, he didn't know where to go, dude. All right, thank you, Gerald. I appreciate it. You have a good one. Let's go ahead and search the vehicle. Make sure there's nothing inside the vehicle that we have to tack on. Any, like, crimes or anything like that. Besides the felony warrant that he need to be picked up on. A nightstick, a jerry can, a large blood stain. A large blood stain? That's... A new... I've never seen that before. That's so weird. And an NFL football. Okay, again, a nice selection of shit. Uh, they're gonna have to check that out at the lab then. I really don't know what that's about. That blood stain. That's for sure. But we'll at least be able to clear this up. I don't even know if he's gonna be able to get out. I don't want him to hit my car. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to get out of here before he gets in. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, now we're good. Now I can at least pull over here. Dispatch, we're gonna be code 4108 available for calls. Shots fired in East Vinewood. All available units respond code three. We got a gang shootout going on right now. It's gonna be East Vinewood, about a half a mile out. We got a code three response. We're gonna be going in. I'm gonna make sure I have the pistol ready. Whoa, 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 whoa! Curb. Gotta love it, dude. Out of the way. It's gonna be just outside of Mirror Park, which is not usually a place where <laughs> gang summits happen. But I guess we're breaking down barriers every day here in Los Santos. Dispatch, you can show me 23. 23 in the area, I'm gonna be rolling up. Oh, shit. We got major shots fired, and we rolling up uh, code two, that way they don't really hear me. Oh yeah, it's going down. Air support in route. Okay, we got to, uh, I didn't even call air support, I don't know what that's about. Okay, we got people walking away. I think he, oh shit, I think I just, I literally just took a stray bullet, dude. Holy shit. Oh! I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I don't know who the fuck, what just happened? Oh my god, hold up. Did the fucking motorcycle crew just fucking run up at me? Oh my god. I was like, wait a second, I- th Oh, that was so bad. That was so fucking bad. What? What happened? That makes no sense. The motorcycle crew wanted to get in on the action. That motorcycle gang really, really... Oh, my car was already there. Oh, my God. That scared the shit out of me. 
I just saw my health depleting, and I was like, oh my god. That is just insane. Fucking Christ. Attention unit one, King one. We have a person carrying a knife on a... Oh, okay, let's get a redemption freeway. since, uh, you know, I just got murdered by people that I really didn't even get called out for in the first place. <laughs> so that's cool. Uh, we got a person with a knife. I think they just... They might have just re... No, okay, it's still there. I thought they disregarded it, but they did not. We're gonna go ahead and get there. Let's go ahead and see what we got. I don't know if they're actually carrying the knife. I believe this is gonna be above us, too. Oh, shit, we got a stabbing. Now we're gonna have to step it up. It's gonna be above, so we're gonna have to flip around. I don't know if we're going to be able to get there in time, especially if the stabbing has already occurred. That's a little concerning. Oh, that's a wall. Dispatch, we're going to be 23 on scene, rolling up at the uh, stabbing right now. I don't see anyone that's in a stressful situation. Please tell me they're not below. Okay, I have a subject here. I don't know if he has a knife in his hand. I think he does, yep. Got hey, a stop. Fuck, he's taking off. Dispatch, we got one running. It's going to be Power Street northbound. Bravo Mike with a striped shirt. Stop. Hey, don't you fucking go for a car. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing, dude. <laughs> what is he doing? I think he wants to steal a car. That is not even funny. Like... But it's like you're getting chased by a police car with lights and sirens. Oh, God, sorry. I'll pay for the damage. Oh, I almost ran him over. Stop running, dude. You're going to get tasered. You're going to get tasered. Oh, I'm surprised I actually hit him. We're going back to pistol. Come on, dude. Get up. Hands up. Get up and put your hands up, dude. It's over. Drop the knife. I, oh, I see fucking blood on the knife, dude. He stabbed someone. Get down on the ground now. You're not cooperating. I'm going to taser you again, dude. Get on the fucking ground. Okay, he's not cooperating, so we're probably going to have to hit him again with the taser. Dude, if you don't get on the ground, you're going to get hit again. Taser. Oh, wait. He just stabbed himself, I think. Come on, dude. Hands up. <laughs> I love how we have to go through like five minutes of tasering with these guys. Come on, hands. I think we're going to have to hit him. Get on the ground right now, motherfucker. Drop the fucking knife. All right, we got him stopped. Okay, we're going to have to render CPR because motherfuckers like to die so quick in this. It's not even funny. We're going to get CPR. Everyone stay back. We got this. Stay back. It's okay. We're certified. Certified personal resurrection. That's what it stands for. We got this. Isn't it like cardiovascular pulmonary... Cardiopulmonary resuscitation? I don't know. Something like that. I can't fucking remember. Come on, buddy. Stand up. You're good. I had to I had to put you down, brother. I had to put you down. You're good, man. Stand up. We're <laughs> we're just going to arrest you. <laughs> oh god. Oh, that's great. I just beat the shit out of you, but you know, turn around cuz now you're going to jail. <laughs> oh my god. Too good. Unfortunately, he did probably just fucking stab someone and murder them cuz the knife was covered in blood, so it's not like he did it. We're gonna pat him down. That siren is gonna make me lose my mind here in a second. Okay. Whole bunch of drugs. So definitely a drug-related uh, overdose probably made him lose his mind. Let's call a prisoner transport in for this guy. Whoa. What the fuck was that? He just insta-disappeared. That was so weird. I'm, I, that's not something that happens often. Okay, dispatch, we're code four with the stabbing. Uh, if we could send out another officer in the area to see if we can locate a victim, please. Be code four ten eight available for calls. Citizens report a person carrying a firearm in hmm. Rockford Hill. 
I like my public transportation with the firearm calls. So it's a code three response too. So we're gonna get out to it. It's actually only a half a mile away too. It's switching up locations. So we we get these, but it's switching up locations, which is nice. It is a little repetitive, it seems like. But in the end of the day, there's only so many calls via the scripts I actually have in game going through LSPDFR and GTA as a whole. So. I mean, the fact that they do change up locations every once in a while is good. I think I've went to this one the most, though, the Rockford Plaza. So it's not a new location, but it's definitely different from the last one that we were out. And it is going to be a code 3 response, so we want to get there as fast as possible. I've never had an individual shoot, though. We haven't got into a shootout inside the uh, Los Santos Transit area. I mean, it just hasn't been a thing that I've seen. So we're going to go ahead and uh, get down there as fast as we can. Try to see if we can locate a subject. I'm not sure if he's walking out. But we got to be a little bit cautious here. Again, haven't had a shooting. Oh! Holy fucking shit! What was that? <laughs> oh my god! You pushing up? Alright, Daryl, relax, man. You weren't even in that shit, bro. Holy fucking shit. Back the fuck up! Damn it, Steve. Holy shit. As I'm saying, yeah, well, we didn't have a shooting. He fucking Matrix dives around the corner and starts unloading. Holy shit, dude. iFruit 9IX. There it is. If you're still alive, do not move. Damn, he threw his gun. Okay, dispatch. We got one down. Multiple shots fired. Weapon is secure. He took a direct face shot right there. That's, that's how that went down. Okay, we're going to call in... Uh, Oh, we're doing CPR. Never mind. I'm doing CPR on a guy that was just shot in the face, so I'm not really sure if that's going to do any one <laughs> good. Uh, I know. Back. Stop running over here. There might be blood everywhere, but you don't fucking run around the corner that it all went down. Holy shit. <laughs> I said, holy shit. He said, holy shit. He is dead. Okay. Oh, and he rebled. That's not... That's not good. Okay, we're gonna have to call a co oh, Fuck, I wanted to call medical, not coroner. There's so much blood, I'm gonna start screaming too! Holy shit! <laughs> like, they're just screaming down there, I'm gonna start screaming. Everyone's screaming. I don't know why this shirtless man had a handgun in the subway. Is everyone good down there? I'm gonna use this PA system. If anyone has been injured inside the Los Santos transit area, please stop screaming. You're not helping. Please make your way towards the front entrance. Thank you. Fuck. You're good. Yeah, yeah, come over here. You're good. No. Oh, they're stupid. They're stupid. Okay, they're gonna take care of the body. I like how I called everyone to the front of the store. I was like, yeah, just come over here and look at the body that's over here. Jesus. All right, cleanup crew is gonna go ahead and take care of that. Oh, what a shit show. Always a shit show in the... I, I've never had it be that bad, though. I've never had a shots fired, especially where he somehow knew I was rolling up. Like, that was fucking weird. I have never seen that before. He was like, oh, cop, six cents around the corner. What the hell, dude? Holy shit. Dispatch, uh, I'm gonna be code 4108 of help for call. We had shots fired. One has been picked up by corner. Oh my god, stupid bitch! Who the fuck does that? You had a fucking red light! It just turned green right now, don't you get back on that fucking bike! Stay the fuck back! You're going to jail, mother- Oh my god! What? <laughs> what? What the fuck just happened? This bus just hit my police car! Insta blew it up, the bus blew up, and now everyone is blowing up over here. Oh shit, why am I getting close to that? Oh shit. Everyone back up, we've got major explosions. I don't even think I have a fire extinguisher. There was someone inside that bus, dude. Oh shit, it's not done. Oh god. It's horrendous. Oh, the door part is on fire. Oh yeah, bus driver down. Oh my god! I gotta get away. Holy shit. It's gonna blow! Damn. 
Next level shit. Even my police car got fucking wrapped up in that shit, dude. Wow. If only the bus driver would have been paying attention, he wouldn't have just simultaneously blew six people up. So, good. Downtown fucking bus ride to hell right there. Oh, poor guy, dude. He had no chance. He really had no chance. Oh, no. One, two, three. Uh, four. Four people inside the bus, including the bus driver, perished. Holy shit. And the fuck- I knocked him out. Don't mind that guy. I knocked him out. He's good. But no one- okay, any, any other people get hit or anything with the explosions or everyone good? I gotta make sure there's no one else. Door part's still on fire and shit, dude. I was not expecting that. Okay, so it looks like we had no other- no other people perish inside this <laughs> vehicle accident here, which killed fucking five. Holy shit, dude. No one's inside these cars. These were all just parked cars. That is infinity fire over there. Yeah, there you go. There you go, buddy. There you go. Okay, I need a police car. Oh, I just hit that guy's <laughs> Gotta love it. Okay, taxi's still fucking up our whole investigation. Good shit, thanks, man. Alright, so let me call out medical for this guy. He, uh... He ran a red light and I hit him. Uh, I'm gonna have to use this, actually. He ran a red light and I hit him. And then he pissed me off, so I smacked him. Because he was gonna... I didn't smack him. Yeah, I smacked him. Uh, but he went- he went to go flee the scene, so I hit him off his bike. And in the process of doing that, the bus went from that side all the way over there, hitting my police car, blowing it up. That caught the bus on fire, which then it blew up next to three parked cars. Possibly four, I'm not entirely sure, where... I think it was four. One flew, though. Uh, and then that's how we ended up with... One, two, three, four, five, six blown up vehicles. That's just insane. And then we have this damaged motorcycle here. This has been the biggest collision I've ever seen on o Occupation and Power Street in my life. Holy shit, dude. He should be good, though. I only smacked him one good time. He did get hit by a car, but... If he's not good, then... Nope. T.O.D. Relax, medic. What the fuck are you... Stop! What are you swearing about? He's just sitting there swearing, dude. He's so, he's so broken. Really? You're such a useless waste of space. You see one blown up person and you're gonna sit there and curse the whole time? You're pathetic, man. You're pathetic. Okay, so we're gonna have a confirm, uh... <laughs> he died. Good. All right, well, this is just working out so fucking fantastic. Dispatch any cornered occupation Alpha. power. I don't usually see female EMS like that in LSPD far, so interesting to see that. Okay, coroner's rolling up on scene. I'm gonna go ahead and get the bike out of the road, get it next to all the other blown up vehicles. Unfortunately, there was a lot of uh, life loss, loss of life and property damage. Here at this one scene, unfortunately. Uh, I, we had nothing to do with it. I did park my car in the middle of the road, but I think I had my lights on if I wasn't mistaken. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, so well, the best thing we're going to be able to do here is... Oh my... Dispatch calling Goodness. One one. We have a oh, they're immediately going to corn... Oh, well, he did die by explosion, so that's... That makes sense. Oh, can I get all these people out, too? I don't know. How did I get that driver out? That was weird. Look, you could tell... Are they going to get all the bodies? There's no way. That's so many people. Okay, yeah, they got the driver. Oh, yeah. Maybe that's why he popped out, because they were running over here. And they were next on the list. Okay, that makes sense. So they're literally going to go through everyone in the car. Everyone in the bus that died. Well, that's good. At least we'll be able to get that before we get it towed. It's a huge scene here. Huge for LSPDFR. That happened randomly. There's just bodies re-unburning and 
laying on the ground, which is a little disturbing. I should probably get a, uh, try to get some type of, like, thumbnail while I'm here, because it's just such a massive scene that it actually looks... Oh, bodies are just falling everywhere. Can we get some assistance here, people? I like how the bus just looks like it's covered in, like, this really sick-ass camo. <laughs> what the fuck? Some digital camo. Okay, they're literally almost done with everyone. That's like five people here. Quick thumbnail, you already know. Some solid amount of work from these guys, though. I'm impressed. Nice job, guys. Okay, so let's go ahead and get... Uh... I don't need to tow it. Or I, need to, I don't need to search it. I need to tow it. <laughs> Wait, how did I just ask for a small tow truck? I want to see this. Go. This is going to be great. I just asked for a small tow truck on a fucking bus. Oh, how is this gonna transpire? Oh, what? Oh, what is going on? What? What the fuck is this? Why is it working? Who? Who let this guy go to work? Who gave this guy his tow truck license? Oh, why is this working? What the fuck? <laughs> That's great. When in doubt, call the fucking small tow truck out. It doesn't matter. They'll handle it all. Okay, so for the rest of them, I'm going to go ahead and use the police car. He is legit. He is going to make it all the way down the road. You don't see that every day, ladies and gentlemen. You don't see a small tow truck come and pick a fucking bus up that's just been blown up. You don't see that, okay? Holy shit. Let's go ahead and get these on the side of the road. That's why we got the ram bar. We might as well use it. If you do not fucking... I'm gonna stop traffic. That way I have room to work. I don't want these guys running up on me every time I get like farther up in the street. Okay, a few more solid hits. They'll be clear. That one should be good. We'll have to send another tow truck crew out here. <laughs> they'll, they'll just send out that first guy who picked up the bus. We should be good. He could pick that up. We'll definitely be able to pick up these ones. Okay, we're going to get that blue one just a little more off to the side, and we should be good. Oh, that cop is so we close to that car. I think he's touching him. Okay, now we're good. Four blown-up cars on the side of the road, all facing the same direction. What more can you ask for? We're just going to park off right here. Dispatch, we are code four on Power Street. If you can go ahead and send uh, four times tow trucks to pick up these vehicles involved in the explosion, that'd be great. It'll be 10 8 available for calls. All right, everyone, that is going to be where we wrap up this episode of LSPDFR in this beautiful Dodge Charger, Los Santos Police Department. Thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode of LSPDFR, and we will see you next episode. Mm -hmm.